Sana Biotechnology has a big type 1 diabetes announcement. Sana Biotechnology has recently achieved a significant milestone in the treatment of type 1 diabetes, T1D, through its hypoimmune platform, HIP, technology. In a first-in-human study, genetically modified islet cells were transplanted into a patient without the need for immunosuppressive drugs. After 28 days, these cells were functioning effectively, producing insulin and evading immune detection, marking a promising advancement toward a potential cure for T1D. This breakthrough addresses a long-standing challenge in islet cell transplantation, the requirement for lifelong immunosuppression to prevent immune rejection of transplanted cells. SANA's HIP technology modifies donor islet cells to evade both allogeneic and autoimmune attacks, allowing them to survive and function without triggering the recipient's immune system. The initial study demonstrated that the transplanted cells not only survived, but also produced insulin, as evidenced by increased C-peptide levels, a marker of insulin production. Importantly, this was achieved without the use of immunosuppressive medications, and no safety concerns were reported during the observation period. These findings pave the way for further development of SANA's SC451 program, which aims to create a scalable, curative treatment for T1D by using HIP-modified, stem cell-derived pancreatic islet cells. The success of this approach could potentially eliminate the need for insulin injections and immunosuppressive therapy, significantly improving the quality of life for individuals with T1D. Here is how the HIP technology works. SANA's HIP-modified islet cells are designed to be invisible to the immune system. They incorporate genetic modifications that reduce the immune response, preventing the body from attacking the transplanted cells. This means patients won't need immunosuppressive drugs, which often have serious side effects and can compromise overall health. SC451, a scalable cell therapy candidate, the success of this study paves the way for SC4V1, SANA's stem cell-derived pancreatic islet cell program. SC451 is designed to be an off-the-shelf product, meaning patients wouldn't need a personal donor or custom cell modification. The goal is to develop a widely available, scalable treatment that could replace daily insulin injections. Implications for type 1 diabetes treatment if successful in larger trials, this technology could revolutionize T1D treatment by eliminating insulin dependence, providing a long-term functional cure, removing the need for immunosuppressants, offering a scalable cell therapy solution. This breakthrough follows similar advances by companies like Vertex Pharmaceuticals, which also develop stem cell-derived islet, islet cell therapies for T1D. However, SANA's immune-evasive approach could give it a unique advantage by avoiding the need for immunosuppression. In this study, donor-derived islet cells are genetically modified using SANA's HIP technology to evade immune detection, allowing for transplantation without immunosuppressive drugs. As of now, SANA Biotechnology has not publicly disclosed a specific timeline for initiating Phase three clinical trials for its Type 1 diabetes T1D treatment. The company is currently conducting early phase studies to evaluate the safety and efficacy of its hyperimmune HEP technology in transplanting insulin producing islet cells without the need for immunosuppression. The progression to phase 3 trials will depend on the outcomes of these early phase studies, regulatory approvals, and further clinical evaluations to ensure the treatment's safety and effectiveness. The idea of genetically modifying cells to evade the immune system is fascinating to this channel and another interesting concept for ridding the world of type 1 diabetes. We will follow this development and keep our audience updated.